In the movie, Don't Tell Mom the Babysitter's Dead, Nicole Richie supports a mother who decides to travel solo around the globe and leaves her children behind. Richie, 42, who has been married to Joel Madden, 45, for 14 years, has a daughter named Harlow, 16, and a boy named Sparrow, 14. Richie claims that she was inspired to follow suit. I said, leave me alone, queen. I must begin doing that right now. I said to myself, I'm stressed too. Richie says to people, please bring me along, I would also like to go on a retreat. Richie appears in the remake of the famous 1991 film, which starred Christina Applegate as a teenage girl who poses as a fashion designer to get a job at a fashion company after her mother, Conchetta Tomei, leaves her kids with an old babysitter who later passes away. The teen character Tanya, Simone Joy Jones, who poses as a woman in her 20s in order to gain the job as executive assistant, reports to her quirky but supportive boss, Rose, who Richie plays in the updated version. Richie was an ardent admirer of the original, so the character fit her perfectly. It seems like I've seen it a thousand times or more. She says to people, I adore that movie. I don't even think I rewatched it before we started filming. I think I just watch it whenever it's on, maybe once a year, or whenever. I adore it, it's comforting. It transports me back. Family adventures are my favorite. She goes on, I adore films where you just have to cheer for the youngster who's trying to make her way and how all the adults feel like outsiders. And that's simply what, in my opinion, makes me feel comfortable, content, and at home. Richie claims that she didn't make an effort to imitate Rose's role in the original film, Joanna Cassidy. Believing that you can just make something better or perform an imitation would be pointless, Richie states. He also notes that director Wade Elaine Marcus really encouraged us to bring ourselves into every character that everyone was playing. I wanted to preserve Rose's essence as much as possible, but keep in mind that we are seeing this adult through the eyes of a teenager, she says. I think I just leaned into that view of how they look at us because I have a teenager and I'm pretty familiar with how they look at adults. Although Richie's kids, who she took to the film's premiere on April 2, had not yet seen it when she spoke with people, she later confirmed on today that they had given it their blessing. Being teenagers, they are quite unconcerned about it. Nevertheless, they told me I did a wonderful job and were delighted to be there. I will accept that, thank you very much, she replied. On April 12, Don't Tell Mom the Babysitter's Dead opens in theaters.